Well, kind forum members of the unofficial Mammoth Forum, here's the um, latest video. I'll just uh, set her going. So we have a Cotswold Heritage Cyclops, which is, I can't pronounce this, Cyclohelicoidal or something like that. Anyway, um, there is a story. My good friend, Dave the Steam, bought this uh, chap. Um, well, actually, he didn't. I did, for a given price. And the flywheel was so badly bent. There was about a quarter of an inch, not joking, out of the flywheel. And at the price I paid for it, I had to send it back. Oh, notice a little ball on the top. He put that on there just to finish it off. I mentioned this to him and he said, in the words of uh, the trotters, you plonker, Rodney, why did you not talk to me first? Uh, but I didn't. And uh, the steam plant bears no resemblance to how it was delivered. So, Dave the steam spoke to the original buyer and said... Do me a deal, send it back, and that duly happened. And, of course, Dave turned a uh, sow's ear into a silk purse. Uh, complete with his usual touches, he uh, made sure that all the wooden um, cladding was added. That, by the way, is, is a Cotswold Heritage boiler with a Cotswold Heritage Shore Fill gas tank. The original builder is worth a note, Oliver Fowler, model engineer, 1927 to 2006. And it was sold by, I believe, his grandson. And I was sorry that I kind of couldn't take it. Uh, Dave's added the water tank with a return. It's a shh baked bean tin which is cladded which is all right isn't it and a little uh, water pump as well reduced the size greatly of the footprint of the static engine and she's purring away on about 10 psi so there she is um very very attractive little engine as you can see purring away one of the most interesting engine movements you could ever have. And of course, thanks to Dave the Steam, it's in pristine condition. And uh, thanks to his generosity, I'm the new proud owner. There you go, guys.